that's kind of creepy. Well, good day, engineers. Welcome back to Railroads Online. We are going to do some construction work today. That big bridge that I want to put in. Uh, we're good there. That's all downhill from here, so. So let's back her up here. We're just loaded with the iron ore again here. But we're going to need more wood up here soon. Not right away, but in the next little while. So to do that, I would like to um, put in that bridge that we were kind of started to work on there last time we were in here. <clears throat> that would make a lot of less work for us to get the wood up here. For sure, if I don't have to go down that valley, was, oh boy, I save a lot of time. So we'll head her down to where we're going to do that junction, which is down here somewhere. And we'll get working on it. I don't know whether I'm going to be able to do a split Y thing anywhere, because I don't think I'm going to be able to get a switch any further back this way on this line. So I don't know exactly what we're going to do there yet. I might have to make it where it goes down, then we have to reverse and then come back up here or something. And it's just a zoo zip right up, but we'll see what we can come up with here. It's all pretty much downhill until we get to the spot where I want to do that junction. So, uh, so that's going to be the downfall of that, um, but we'll see what we can do. Hoping it might might work for us, but so I imagine this is going to take us a good chunk of today's video is getting this bridge working here. Awesome. We could have just gone straight across there, but I don't want to stretch the whole valley with bridges. We'll just do one bridge across, I think. How those silly how those switches they gotta go on they gotta go on a flat spot they just will not mesh into any kind of a hill. We're soon going to have to, oh, oh, just dreading this one, make way to the coal mine. I think once we get our punch through, we'll be all right. It's not terrible bad, but it's, uh, it's a trek. But now that I kind of have in my head how to do these bridges, we might have a little better success than what I'm thinking. Because um, that's a pretty... It's a pretty wicked spot <laughs> to get into that thing. There's a lot of hills and valleys and stuff you got to make over, and that'll yeah, be fun. I got to think of it that way. It's going to be fun making way to the coal mine. We got to take uh, rails, which we've got some making down here, bringing this stuff down. We got to make rails, take them up there, and beams, and then we need these cars for picking up the coal, bring it all the way down to. Um, Lost thought of it. Um, no, wrong button. Yeah, take it all the way down to the coal mine needs uh, iron works, I believe it is. Could be one of the other one too. I can't remember. We'll figure that out when we get to it. Oh. oh. I 
that actually stopped there. Oh, I got a break on that's why. That won't be helping. Now this would actually be a good spot here to to veer off, but oh, that's such such a such a long way, and it'd be hard to get back up here. You could just veer right across there with your bridge, but I guess we'll have to try to do it down here. If it gets real bad and I don't like where we've got her going, I'll maybe try that, but uh, we'll try this here, I think. Or even right here, I could shoot her that way, but I have to go down below here and draw a bridge across, and then draw another bridge across, and then draw this bridge across up to here. So I'm going to just try this one for today. More or less just to see if it works or anything, but I think it should, but now some of this we can probably get rid of here to make it look a little better. Maybe I'll try to stop here. It might stop there enough. Okay, let's um... Oh, I did her again. Let's demolish. Oh no. They really need to do have an undo button. I think that was a little better route that we took going up there using that. Straight through. Okay, that's gone. That's great. That would be really cool to whoa to take off this bridge after and just have it go and uh, with just track across. Oh man, that would be weird. Uh, I'm gonna leave this little spot naked here though. Should get rid of all that too, but it's going to get rid of all this. Uh, we better leave that alone. Um, okay, so let's maybe leave this guy up here for now. No, we'll go down past. We'll go down past. We shall go down past, I think. But if I could get this switch to go in here and swoosh over. That'd be great. I don't think that's going to work there, though. Woo, boy. Yeah, if I get that switch in here and we could get it just to... Well, I'm going to say swoosh. Swoosh up here. Oh, boy. That would save us a lot of messing about. But I don't think... No, we need to switch to the left. Switch to the left. Oh, look at the angle of that. If I go down more, could maybe squeeze it in there. Oh, it's going to reverse it to here, though. I don't really want to pop that out unless I know for sure that that's going to fit in there. Um, oh, why do I keep hitting tab? Switch to the left. Now, if that would go there, that would actually probably work. Oh, I don't know why it keeps doing that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it, I guess. I better put this back to rails. Okay, I'm gonna try try it here. Um, ooh, that would be so nice. Oh, again, huh? That would be so nice if I could get this to work. Uh, switch to the left. Now that seems different there. Now I wonder if I did it up. See, I'm losing my. Yep, yeah, it's going to have to go there, I guess. Well, that'll work. Ah! Oh. I just... Well, i got to redo that now. Oh, my goodness. Rails, switch to the left. Okay, now this is going to need to be all rerun here.
That'll work. Okay, let's knock a couple of these trees out. And figure out where we're going to go with this. Um, bridges. Yeah, okay, we're going to knock these trees out here too, because we're going to come straight out and then start to turn about here somewhere. Um, what about these ones? Better do these maybe too. Come on. Silly tree. Okay, that ought to clear that enough. Let's get back up here and start drawing a bridge out to kind of the edge. So first of all, we'll do maybe a bit of this stuff here. We'll start that. There. Bridge. I'd like to get this to start to turn right now, if it would, but it's... Well, it might be high enough to clear that, you know? Um, what do we got to do here? Curve radius. I keep forgetting how to do this. X and Y. Okay, that kind of messed up a little bit. Now that almost looks, I guess, hopefully that's high enough. By the time we get over there, we might have to actually bring it down a little bit. I still haven't figured out these steel trestles yet. What am I doing here? I need to bridge this one. I still haven't figured out the steel trestles yet. Whew, that looks awful high, doesn't it? All right. Um, I know that one still has to go up, so we can't go by looking at that. That's for sure. Now I got to get down here somehow, and uh, oh, good thing no fall damage. I have to draw a bridge out here. That's about center there. And we'll s see if that's enough now for that other one. Probably don't need to take these out. Yeah, we need no fly mode or no clip mode. That'd save a lot of messing about. To me, that looks like it's going up in the air. I, I think it's staying level. Oh, but, um, I don't know. Oh, didn't like that. No, I'm not right here yet. Whoa, gonna have to start off a bit higher, I guess, with that bridge. Now it's kind of weird how these bridges work. But they work. They seem to work somehow. Okay, if I can get this just to come right out here now. I 
I think we should be all right. Okay, what a mess. <laughs> I think it's going to work, though, I think. I hope. I hope it. this one meshes to this one now, even though it's not really close. Don't know whether I can get her much higher. It's definitely a weird way to do it, so I don't know. We'll figure it out here, though. Heck is that clouds? Huh. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see what we can do here. It's gonna mesh up for me now. Can't really tell where you gotta be though. That's the problem. It's still not meshing up. Um, okay, well, what else do we got to do here to relieve that? Something we're missing here. It's weird because it works fine the other way. Didn't like that. Well, I'm. Oh, I might have to try to trick it here. Um, It's not one to curve for me. Oh, sure, now it curves. Okay, it's kind of messy looking, I know, but uh, hopefully it works here. And all this should hopefully mesh to this now, once we get back up top here. Runner across. Sounds nice with the river there, doesn't it? Very nice. Bridges, bridges, wooden trestle, wooden trestle. Oh man, why is this still not working? There we go. Oh, I better not. Uh, Plunk that, uh, better plunk it down, or, oh yeah, I was way off, I guess, I see now. Whew, gotta start bringing her over here soon. Oh, we 
are going to have to come down quite a bit here, aren't we? We are quite a bit higher. That's a just an absolute horrible looking bridge. Oh boy. Well, by the time we actually get up to there, we'll have to get her straightened out here, I guess. Oh, where the heck is this one? We're actually over here quite a piece. We're really high here, though, and this isn't kind of working. Ah. Uh, I mean that's it's in it's not great though I don't like that I'm just not a great bridge builder you're still way too high I think we're way too high I wanted to kind of keep it level, but um, that was a little crazy. <laughs> that one's just not coming around for me. I don't know if I like that or not. We might just maybe do this one here. It'd be nice if I could just maybe turn and go that way too. Uh, let's see here. So we got a bit of an uphill to do there. That's going to be quite an uphill I think. Maybe if we can get this to work. Ooh, boy, oh boy. I don't think I'm going to get her up fast enough here. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, no, I want to log. Cut, will ya? Um, okay, so this is... If this, I can get it to here, we might be all maybe right. little bit of a curve there. <laughs> I think it's all right. Maybe though it's going to be awful tight. Really should start back more with that curve, but ah uh, boy oh boy. boy hey we won't know if it's good or not failure until we try it right now that 
that's not working good there. Groundwork demolish. Okay, so we got to we're going to get rid of this bridge, I think here. Um That just that just was uncontrolled. This one here. Oh, what a mess. Gotta gotta delete all this. I don't know how far I can actually go away to delete something. I just don't want to delete that one. So we still gotta bring that one up after two. Yeah, delete that far away. That's good. This one should be good for the there. Holy smokes. Long away deleting. That's great. Delete, delete, delete. What a mess. I think we environmentally got it all clean again, though, which is good. Okay, and this, we're going to have to uh, somehow join that to that. I think we better use this stuff, though, here. Oh, that's going to be too close to there. Little, oh, yeah, and that's... Uh, no, that sh should be all right. little off there, but let's see if we can just blend that in. Oh, I don't like where that was clipping together. They still need to do some work on their uh, clipping stuff. Okay, you won't even see it. Oh, this is a wicked turn here, though. I don't know, boys. Ah. Uh, I think it's still going to be doable. It'll look better when the track's on it. But now i got to figure out this part here for a switch. It shouldn't be too... Well, yeah, I'm going to have to fudge this a little bit, I think, here. Rails. Switch to the right. Is that what we want? Yeah. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, actually we should do a save. Um, I don't know whether this is going to work nicely here or not. I don't like the way that's kind of joining. Why is that doing that? Oh, it's going uphill here, that's why. Uh, boy, I don't like that either. Uh, let's push her back a little more here. Gonna have 
to do a little bit of a change here, I guess. Um, bridges. Really? That looks terrible. I will agree with that. That'll give me enough to just lay down the one we need here. Whew. I'm not a bridge builder. I'm going to admit that right now. <laughs> This is turning here. Something tells me I'm going to have to redo this. Holy smokes. Well, how much of a nightmare does... Well, she's a little tight here, but we're not going to be going, you know, Mach 20. Oh, this isn't greatest right here, but we'll have to sh try her out, I guess. Ooh, there's an awful rise there. I don't know if that's going to have a problem or not. But that's going up. That's where we need to have it going. So the only thing I could do is maybe start back further here, but then I won't be able to put the switch down. Okay, the next hurdle. Oh, that's weird. That's really messing that up. Okay, let's figure out where we got to come off of here first, I guess. I think it's further over. I could probably start arcing it more. Yeah, we got to get up to basically up to here. Where was it we were taking that off of here? Was it off of that line? Or do we... We started another line here. That's right. Okay. Weird little thing here, too. I don't understand that either, but it's where the thing's joined, I guess. All right, well, let's see what we can do. Just try to keep her coming up, I guess, here. Maybe she'll kind of meet where we want to up there. We'll um, maybe start going to this stuff here, though. It's not rising up fast enough. Oh.
Now that's too fast, I think. We'll figure it out here. Don't worry, we'll figure it out. Telling you. Alright, nightmare, but I think we might be able to make that. If we need to come this way, that is. We might not need to come this way, I don't know. Oh, what is with these things rising up like that? Looking pretty good. I thought we had a little quirk there, but I think we're all right. No way to run the deck along here, but I just gotta run this stuff. quite right was it no oh yeah we should do another save actually this game crashes I know it does I've lost quite a few games um, save games actually gonna have to do this a little differently redo this here I think So that's just coming down a little too fast. So we'll just add more lumber. So I could probably get rid of... Well, that'll get rid of all that too, I guess. But we'll start up here. as mud. Alright, still not liking this little junction right there. I don't know what to do about that. Um, <sighs> tell you, this is sort of working, but it's not exactly how I imagined it coming out. Okay, that should be all good to the switch. We gotta make this go up here now. And join it up there, and uh... Oh, yeah, I'm not liking that. Uh, I'm not liking that. I don't know what to, to do about that, but I'll we'll give her a try, I guess. See what happens. So, we need to see if this is gonna let us... I don't need that much. Uh, well, I guess... Whoop. Well, let's do another save anyways while we're here. I know lots of saving. 
I guess just have to, eh. How do we do that? Uh, I don't know. It's too far up. I don't want to fall off. Man, if this works, I'll be, like, amazed. This is such a mess. I think it's better that we did there what we did there instead of that other bridge we were working on that just that just getting too cobbled cobbled up all right we will hook this up and uh, we're gonna deliver that stuff first and we might go grab the uh, the other well, it doesn't really need. Doesn't really need wood yet, but whoa, that messed up. But maybe by later today, maybe we'll grab a load of wood and try her out here. All right. Okay, let's. Uh, oh boy. Oh boy. Let's hit her across and try that out. I guess. Well, let's head it across this. Ooh, this this is not so good looking right through here. I might redo this. Just this little section here, I think. Probably the rest of it's not great either. But hey. Hey, you'd think by now I'd know what I was doing. But I think we should be able to get from point A to point B. That's eh, a little workerly here still, but I think that'll be alright. Alright, looks like a little bit of a climb still here, which is, uh, we could have probably... Yeah, we could have, now that I see that, we could have brought this up a little more and met a little more level up over there, and then uh, <clears throat> not so much of a hill over here, too. If it's going to be a problem, then we might have to change that. And that's going to be a lot more messing around. Oh, this is really bad here, too. Okay, we'll fix this as well. Right to that one. And I see it's not great there either. Oh, man. I must be new at this or something. Oh, that's not going to work. <laughs> she would not glide nicely across that one. And that's probably all messed up too. I think it'll be all right. I'm not a professional track layer, I must say. Sometimes it does not look good at all. <clears throat> like this part here. This will have to be fixed, too. Okay, well, <clears throat> it's not great, but you know what? I, I, it should work, hopefully. But yeah, we could definitely... Uh, we definitely have brought this up some more here. But I am willing to give her a shot. Okay, my hand would work for my mouse here. Oh, yeah, another good thing. You know what else it is, too, is my uh, gaming chair I'm sitting in 
here. It rolls so easily on my floor here that the chair starts to roll away and it drags the mouse with it because my hand's attached to my arm, right? <laughs> and, you know, I'm sitting on the chair, so... <clears throat> I don't really know if I like this corner here. Well, I guess the only thing we can do is to give it a try here. Um, I guess we'll try it with the... Uh, carts we got on here. <laughs> I don't know. Um, oh, we got to finish this here, too. Got to finish this one. Okay, why can't I get the mouse to work right from here? What's going on? I don't know if I like it like that corner. Well, hmm. Hmm. We'll have to try it, I guess. All right, well, let's let's back her down, I guess, here. We'll probably have to restoke this thing, I would imagine. This is just a just a really bad track today. I did not do well on this track at all. <laughs> this is just a horrible mess. Oh, man. But, uh, you know, if it's going to work, well, we can... Improve it later, maybe. All right, that should heat her back up. Let's pull ahead. We'll switch the track and we'll try to back down there and see if we go good or not. in the middle there. I wonder if it's switched the right way. Get this. So no. Uh, we need groundwork. This thing. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. Let's just see if we got any breaks. No breaks on that one. The first car might still actually have some brakes on, maybe. I don't remember now. It's been a while. No, we're all clear. Okay. All right, here goes nothing. Uh, maybe we will save. Okay, back her up there, Fred. Release the brakes. Oh, boy. <laughs> here we go. I think I definitely need to make this come off of here and turn. That might be a bit too sharp of a turn down there. I think it would be better if we came right off of here and then joined in. <clears throat> but we'll give this a shot here and see. Let's keep some brake on. i got to remember this is going to be bringing over a bunch of wood and stuff, right? And beams and stuff. So far, so good. Kind of surprised. It looks like that switch is in the right spot there, so we'll always take it off on this. Oh, it's down a little bit more net. Got to get rid of these trees here too, I guess. Well, hey, it seems to be working. It's a long way up. But that's all right. It's working good. That little down there is not terrible bad, but it's not great. <laughs> oh boy. Hey, you know what? That. that I think will actually work. Wow. That's going to save us a pile of time, that's for sure. Well, I guess we'll go up. Maybe try to take this down the hill, too. We'll uh, just keep moving here. here at 
anything. I can't see this switch up here yet. Uh, did it connect it? <laughs> I guess we'll find out. We'll find That is going to save us a lot of time instead of going all the way down and around up there with the lumber. Oh, man. We're going to get wood up there so much faster now. This is going to be great. I can't wait to try that. No real climbing either. So climbing up the other side would really suck. Hey, this is working go out and delete all these bridges again so we just have the... I really don't want to, but that would be kind of neat. Delete all those bridges. Okay, what is... I think I gotta stop and switch that. I can't quite see from here, but uh, looks like it's going the other way, yeah. Okay, hopefully this thing will stay here. It's not that steep, but it's steep enough. Oh, wow. This is going to work all fine and dandy. This is going to be just fantastic. It's not too, too bad probably to get going here. Again, it's not that steep, but steep enough. Okay. Let's go and back her up here. and Switch that switch and we'll head down with our load of stuff. If we can get her going here again. Uh, okay, let's see here. We'll just get her, give her a regulator to start with and then let the brake off. Here we go. Oh, that was pretty good. Now we'll see how uh, well we get down the hill here with this. Oh, boy. I was expecting them to slow down a little more. <laughs> it's going uphill. It should. Hey, get back here. Get back here, Trey. <laughs> Holy crap. Stop. <whistles> wow, I just wanted to keep going. That's that's fantastic. Alright, I kind of think coming down this hill, we ought to better put on a little bit of... holding its own there, so that's good. And remember, this is a fairly heavy load. These things are... What are they? 55.11 apiece. So that's... Uh, oh, yeah, me and my memory brain can't do that. Sorry. 55.11 times 4. 55.11 times 4. I'll give you an exact number. 22,044 pounds. So that's heavy enough. putting on power I'm going down a hill because that car is grabbing so nice so we're probably about ready to um, take some rails and some well you know what I got a better map thing here let's just take that off I did get a better map and I should actually print it out of what goes where and what needs what really got to get to the coal mine actually next so maybe we'll uh, take some wood we'll try this up here today we'll grab some wood on the trailer there and uh, or on the cars there and uh, try that out after we dump this off of here 
And uh, we'll try our new route up there and see if that's super awesome. And um, the next time we get together, maybe we'll start trekking up to the uh, coal mine. It's going to be a, a busy day, that one. I don't think they're going to tackle all that today. And uh, yeah, that's going to take us a bit to get up there. It's, it's quite a piece. It's, uh, you know, we've got to go from basically the smelter kind of up the, well we'll, well, well, we'll we'll do the wood. And we'll leave the train kind of where that junction is kind of up over here that goes up on the other side of this mountain here all the way back there. It's a long way. Oh, this is actually handling this pretty good down here. I'm kind of surprised. And we've got the track in the wrong spot there. Don't know whether he'll get stopped before then. Maybe. Uh. Whew, that was actually pretty good. We can try to take this off now. You notice something with this? We haven't had to put water in for like ever. Oh, this one's not the right way either. Um, okay, so we'll let him roll ahead and we'll run ahead here. Yeah, we haven't had to put water in for like ever. Which is kind of weird, but it's true. It's We haven't had to. I don't know what they've done with that. They seem to have changed, changed that now. I don't really understand why. I mean, normally these things would eat up water like pretty quick. I think the way they had it was more realistic. This one's still at 3,600. Like that's insane. All right, we made her down here, all good. That's great. Except now we got the train in the wrong way, so we're gonna have to drop these cars, I guess, off here. Probably should pull ahead and grab onto these cordwood cars too and take them up with us when we go up there. We got them up there ready for picking up some more cordwood. All right. So if we're going to do that, what I will do is switch this one, get ready for this one here. And then we'll go up and switch that one too. See, I could use another line down here where I could just go out and then back in and around, but uh, we, can, we can just go around, I guess. It's not that far. That's great. We got that line in today. We'll give her a shot. We'll take up some, some wood up there. Pre-thinking ahead, actually, you know, we should probably take up these these hopper cars, too. We can leave them up here, because I think that's probably where we're going to need them next. We could leave them on that other spur. For when we go down to get coal, we still need to make route down to... Uh, well, hang on a sec here. We still need to make route down to a couple of plants down below the freight yard there. Where did that picture go? There it is. Um... So yeah, the coal mine will give you coal, but it needs beams and rails, which we have both of each, once we get there. <laughs> um, the crude oil place... No, no, sorry, the... Uh, what am I looking at here? Oil field needs pipes, beams, and tools. So we can do beams there, but we can't do... We, can't, we haven't been to the iron works yet, and they're the ones that need the coal raw iron. So that's what we would do after the coal mine. We'd have to get, make tracks down to there. So, um... Yeah, I guess, you know what? I'm gonna get this guy ripping here. We'll get the rest of these unloaded. We 
these guys would be all out of cordwood now. There's one more load there we could unload, though. But I think we'll take all this... Oh, man, it always dumps you out the wrong way. I think we'll take all these cars up with us. And how much money we got now? Ugh, not much. <laughs> 2200 Um, okay. So these guys are out of cordwood, so they're not making much, but we're gonna go around... Those are empty. We'll go around and meet him over here. We'll meet him over here just to make sure this track's in the right way here, which it's not. We got rails and lots of raw iron. Well, that's good. We need to take the rails up to the coal mine whenever we make our way up there. What's our numbers at here now? 100. Ooh, we're full there. Raw irons are down a bit. 70 of 100. So if we take that other uh, cordwood there, they could use that for sure. All right, he's coming around. That's good. We'll uh, maybe even just meet him up here. Well, it doesn't really matter, I guess. Oh, he's coming around, that's for sure. <laughs> he is on a mission. So, yeah, we'll take these up and I guess hook. That's going to be a long train. Whew, hook the four cars for the cordwood, too, because we're going to need that as well. And um, I don't exactly know how we're going to unhook things to get the cordwood back down here again. Oh, he is ripping. Should settle himself down. We'll get this switched. Hit the switch. Oh man, I gotta fix that because you get stuck on that. Sometimes you're gonna need that in a hurry. And this guy here will put a loop on. Loop. Go back into these cars. in there, bud. Smack down there too hard. Alright, that should settle in there nice. Oh, I derailed it. Oh, it bounced off too. What the heck? That actually did derail that back car, didn't it, this one? Might be able to drag that back off, maybe, and realign it. I don't know what's going on here, why it did that. It's going to come back again, probably hit it too hard again. <laughs> Whoops. Sometimes we'll realign it. Uh, we might have to manually get in there and do something, though, maybe. Hard to say. make sure these are hitched and save again too hitched uh, not too good here <laughs> we'll just go real 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 gentle here and see it'll probably disconnect that back car like that's totally not right the way that's sitting right there right now but anyways let's do a save here they really need to get the uh, escape key integrated in 
going back on menus too because they don't uh, seem to let you do that. All right, we'll uh, we'll just go real gingerly here. Just tighten things up a little bit, and maybe they'll. Uh, I think she snapped back on. Well, lucky there. All right, we'll get this cordwood off here, and then it should uh, last oh about ten seconds. Maybe. Sit there. Yeah, it always dumps you off the front. Man, that's annoying. Okay, so we're going to have pretty much a full plant here, I think, pretty well with uh, with the rest of this cordwood going in. Now, hopefully that's... Yeah, that's not too far away, I don't think. We better get that unloaded. She's slipping back on us. Yeah, that's going in there, so... Okay. That's good. We'll head her up the hill, and we'll hook on to the big cars, and I'll uh, have to get some cordwood loaded, I guess, too. So we got a bit of work to do before we can go across that bridge. Can't believe that snapped back on there. That's great. Okay, here we go. Momentum should be. Yes, sir. Oh, I gotta catch up. Should be good. As long as I don't touch those switches, <laughs> we'll be good. All right, gotta figure out what we're gonna do up here. Um, we need to go. I think to the left and back in and then maybe I have to come back this way and turn the train around it all depends where my cars are I just don't really remember where I left them I know they think they're up here on that line so we might be in trouble here we might have to uh, push them in forwards first here 
There's the log carts. I can see them. Where, oh where, did I leave my cars? They might be over by the train station too, actually. There's the lovely express line. That's good. Um, well, they don't see them on, I was thought I might have left them on here. I don't see them on that line. So, we're gonna maybe go this way and then back down and then hook on to them things. Where are they? Really? Switch that to to come back, I guess. So oh, yeah, they're all uh, they're all waiting over there for us. Yep, yeah, okay. That's good. Now I probably should have gone up to get the cordwood first. Thinking. If I could get over to that line, which we can, we can actually back over there and get the cordwood first, but I don't have this hook to anything yet. I'm going to have to rework this maybe here. Somehow. Um, good there. Whoa, jeez. Going to have to rework that line. I probably don't... I'm going to do that. That's going to be a real tricky one. Get back way up there and get the cordwood first, and then come back down here and get get uh, those other cards hooked on. Let's see what we can engineer here to get that line to hook back up to that line. This might take us a little bit of thinking here. Let's see what we can do. Let's see. Well, first of all, we'll switch this. And then we'll switch this. Because we want to head this way. That line here will take us up to the other car, so that's not where we want to go. That one gets us to the express line. I mean, technically, I could just run this to a dead spur here, but I think if I can find... S oh, no, wait a minute. This isn't going to work. That's just going to take us around there again. Okay, that's not where I really wanted to go. But it would work. It would give us, you know, instead of a dead track... Let's, uh, let's try to stick this switch in here. It's fairly straight. Uh, no. Uh, rail switch to the left. Oh, boy. That'll hook up there. close. Okay, well, we'll just demolish another section of that then. Okay, and this... I'll have to try to do it here again. Okay, that'll work. Now this, I'm going to have to get some groundwork pulled off of here. Groundwork. Sort of, kind of.
groundwork. Oh boy, this is going to be a tight turn here. Uh, I think I'm going to have to come out a little more than that with it. So we've got to go. Yeah, we've got it right way there. Um, okay, this isn't great looking groundwork here. Because this is probably going to make a, a rise on us here. Because it always seems to seem to be up. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we're going to have to rework this a little bit here yet. Uh, hmm. Eh. Okay. That's good. Now. Now let's rethink this here. This still isn't going to get us to where we want to be though, does it? It will it? No, it won't. But we can back over here. I'm sure there's enough room to get everything, hopefully, and then I can, well... Let's have a look here. If we back it all the way over here, this isn't great right here. But uh, we get her up to here. Get the train in. Yeah, I'm going to have to push those cars back a little bit. And then we can go down this line. And then we can go get our cordwood. Then we can back in here and hook to those guys. And then we'll have to back it all the way around. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of messing around here. They've still got a few logs left too, so that's good. I haven't had that guy going for a wee bit. Yeah, that didn't exactly go where I wanted it to. I'd rather have had it go uh, come onto this line here, but uh, I think that would have been just too much, too much angly turning there. So, anyways, it's a little messed up here, but a little bit of running around, we should get this to work here. I think. So technically, yeah, we didn't really need this extra line, but uh, now that one is going to be going. Yeah, that's the right way for us there. So we could even do it again and jump over to that third line there, and then it would still take us to the exact same spot. But, um, oh well, it works. It should be fine. Well, let's back it up to uh, the other cars. Or anyways, we're going to have to push them back a little bit to get the train far enough over there. But uh, we'll uh, try this out. Let's do another save here. Let's do a save. Okay, well... Why that so far up there? I'm just a shrimp today. Holy smokes, I don't know if I can get back in here. There we go. Okay, let's back her up and uh, we'll go grab some cord wood. I think everything should be set. It's good. Don't really need to be dragging all these up here, but we will, I suppose. It's a little 
little bit of a roundabout way to do it. I guess we could actually would have been better if we just went down our express line. Our other express line to the cordwood there. That would have worked better. And save doing all this mess, but we're here now, I guess, so we'll just do it this way. Well, I should probably try this out anyways, right? Not that we'll probably really, really use this line, but, you know, it's here if we need it, so... Probably not ever going to need this. Hey, but you never know. Make a link, I guess, right? Make a link. It could have probably just come right off of this one somewhere here and then done a switch into this guy, but I think this one's on kind of a general angle the whole way around, so it's going to be kind of a, kind of a nuisance to do that, but... Which is set from there. It's been a while since we've used our nice express line down here, though, isn't it? Down to uh, we really haven't needed it because we you know, it's basically was when we were taking the, the lumber down. extra work for us here, but uh, yeah, we should have just gone back up and come down our chute for that. But, uh, well, it's alright. We want to see if this works. So far, so far it's working. So, let me think, how are we going to do this? This is going to be tricky to get this cordwood. I don't really want to drag it all the way up there. We, um, gonna have to do a bit of work, I think, with speed. I should have, well, I mean, I guess I don't have to take it down right now. Or would we just leave it up here? I might come back the exp going the wrong way, then. I'll have to figure out something, I guess. I don't handle those cars too hard there. Oh, that was a bit too hard. Here's hoping I put a brake on on those cars back there. <laughs> They're not going to just keep rolling. The only thing I can think of we are, what we're going to do is we'll head down the hill with all the wood loaded. We'll stop and unhook these maybe and then go down and drop the cordwoods off keep these on because we'll take those up and park them on the other side of our place there. Um, on the other side of the bridge there, I mean, sorry. Okay, let's just make sure something's telling me that there's no brakes on on these other cars here. It's still rolling fairly freely there. No brakes. Okay. Well, we'll go grab some cord wood. And uh, got to make sure that all these are switched. That one is, I know for sure. Should be all coming with us. Good. Quieter, so I must be getting ahead of it. That's good. <laughs> Do 
Okay, we'll need her back there to hook on the other guys, and then, um... Uh, we're gonna do that, too, now. I'm gonna have to hook on that way. Back all the way up. Pass the last switch there, and come down the hill. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Well, let's get on her. turn here. I mean, I guess I could have gone a lot wider with it. Could have come right down here and turned and into those trees. We're going to take a lot more trees out of them. I mean, it works, but you just got to you think really super fast at it. actually let the fire would get way way down it's gonna take a long time to restock all that though I'd have to do that to probably take me half an hour just to put enough stuff in there yeah that's all right all right I don't think we're gonna have enough track here for all this to park so we're gonna have to probably extend that out some more I think there's four cars plus the engine to get the other four cars might be tight. So. I know it's a lot further around, but it's a lot simpler than just switching in the back and in here. I mean, either way works, but this seems to work pretty sweet. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to probably extend our track. Thinking. Just a little bit for a little more room. Almost 
there. Oh, it's gonna be, yeah, uh, we're gonna have to extend her a little bit. So we're gonna take this tree out. Should be enough to extend. If I get back up there, not now. We down here. Really? <laughs> okay. Groundwork. One of these. Rails. One of these. That should be more than enough, I'm thinking. Clear some of these out of here. You never know, you might come in here with more cars at one time, right? So. Okay, well, we got some loading to do here. I probably won't make you sit here and watch me do all this, because this does take a little bit. But I'll do the first couple here for you, just to, just to get you refreshed. Whoa! Just about hit me there, bud. Okay, so we'll get this loaded, and uh, we'll head her back down and uh, get the other ones loaded, too. All right, the boys are just loading, loading the last load there. You know what I mean. We should do something cool. We should have a goat. <laughs> Loading track! Come on! Oh, I didn't get back to the sweet. Floating track. Look at that, eh? Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, back her up. Oh, sorry, I didn't have my boom mic down there. I'm, I'm sure you could hear me, but now you can probably hear me better. Sorry about that. I didn't have my mic down. Anyways, floating track. There we go. Sorry about that. I totally forgot. I didn't have that down. My bad. I usually put it up out of the way so I don't hit it or something when I'm uh, not recording stuff. Alright. Cool floating track. That's what I want to do with the bridge, but I'm like, nah, gotta have the bridge there. It makes it look better. So that's all loaded, good to go. We'll back, we're way back down here. We'll hook back on to the, um... Save that actually again. Uh, hooked onto the other cars, we'll get those loaded. I'm gonna let him cycle around there. We're just gonna shortcut and go over here. Like we're waiting for the train to come in, it's sitting on the bench. I don't see it yet. It's not coming. Where is it? Where's the train? It looks like the track ends there, doesn't it? No, it doesn't. <laughs> Where's the chain? I don't see it yet. It's not coming. Oh, man. Is he on time? Look at the watch. Uh, he's a little bit uh, a little bit late. Still don't see him. Go talk to this guy. When's the chain coming? Oh, hey, the train's coming! Right now, son. He's on time. Your watch is ahead. That's what he tells you. That uh, seemed to snake around there pretty good, so that's good. I'm happy with that. We will hitch a ride, though, whenever we get around here. Remote control trains, eh? Can you imagine? Oof. Sad thing, sad thing to sort of tell you on the way back here. Orangeville here, my hometown, has had train yard in it for a lot of years. They've abandoned it finally. Not finally, but I don't want to say finally, but after all these years, since like early 1900s, late late 1800s, I think it was, when they were started building this thing, they've, they've abandoned the train now and sold all the land off. 
They owned the track from Orangeville all the way down to Brampton. They actually owned a station-y kind of thing down in Brampton. They sold it for $42 million. <laughs> oh, the Callus of the Thames is laughing to the bank with that one. So it's like, what? So now, the far side of town where they used to go, they used to have a small shunting train like the ones with uh, basically a little cab at the back and the little square on the front, whatever they call them things. They had one of those, and they used to do... Um, stuff for the factories in town here, bringing in uh, supplies and stuff, mostly plastic stuff, so they come up from Brampton with the plastic pellets and stuff in the city, whatever, you know. Grab it down there, bring it up here, bring it to the yards. Well, now they're not doing that, so they've had to retrofit everything and change everything again there, because then not everything has to come by truck, so they are, they got a machine, it's an um, excavator basically on wheels that has um, track provisions on it too to, to follow the track and they're tearing up track ripping up ties yeah it's gonna be gone it'll be a walking walking trail now so I mean that's a real major infrastructure that was purposely put in our town a lot of years ago to bring goods and stuff this way and they're not even doing it now so that's a bit sad You know, you can move a lot of stuff on rail, right? I guess it's got good and bad aspects of it. It is probably kind of polluty. All the stuff they dripped on the ground and all the creosote and crap from the, you know, all the pollution stuff is probably not good. The trains themselves, I guess, make some pollution, although they're probably a lot better now than they used to be. But anyways, that's the sad thing. It's happened in our town here, and uh, there will be no more of that, so... Well, we'll have more walking trails, I guess. But they sure scooped up the, the track fast, so not taking the ties quite as fast, but they're scooping up the tracks fast and taking them to scrap, I guess. So that's pretty sad, too. Oh, well. Prosper, I guess. Or prosperous. Or prospering. Not prospecting, that's for sure. But I think how many hours that would have been of those guys. They would have probably put all that stuff in pretty much manually way back in the day. And they just tore it up in, like, a couple of days. Gone. <laughs> loaded on a little, he had a little wagon on the back of him too to put the rails onto it, you know, and they, I think they did go through and cut some of the sections first, but he was just ripping them right out. You know, it was pretty cool, so tearing them right out, but uh, anyways. It's too bad. It was a good uh, industry, infrastructure for the town here, but you know, and then they have go trains down the, you know, like the train the passenger trains down in, like, Mississauga and stuff comes into Brampton. They could have still been using that, but no, no. No, we don't want that. Okay, when this comes here, I'm going to jump off here and uh, switch this switch back here. I'm just going to save again just before we get into these turns and stuff. Not going super fast here, but fast enough. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Gotta fix that, I guess. Oh, oh, I did that a little bit too soon, I guess, didn't I? Whoops. Huh. Wasn't well, that interesting? <laughs> I wonder if it's gonna right itself here at all or just fall off. Well, that's uh, pretty interesting. Maybe when it comes into the next switch... Oh, there she goes. Well, I got some work to do here now, it looks like. Guess maybe we'll just go back here and put this loop hook thingy on here before I forget to do that. Switched her just a little too early. Oh, boy. This actually might have enough speed up here to make its way all the way back, but we'll have to fix it other one. Oh, man. Might keep rolling here. It might lose its speed. I don't know. Well, that was my mistake. I'll just let that roll. Oh, it's still moving fairly quick. Yeah, it 
might actually make it back there. Oh man, I can't believe we flipped the train over. That's not too good. These things do not really go nicely back on curves. So we'll uh, have to... That guy there. It's going to be backwards, is it? No, it's good. Wait a minute. Where did the other one just go? What? I lost a car. Oh, there it goes. Okay, well, we're not going to save that. We'll uh, we'll just reload here, I think. Okay, let's try this again here, and I won't hit the switch quite so fast. Not quite so fast. <laughs> Okay. Whoa, almost fell off again. Yes, we got to make sure we get past the yellow there. That's what happened there last time. So that wasn't so good. It's kind of nice to highlight that for you, because if you do get that messed up, well, you're in some trouble. All right, that should be clear enough there every time that thing moves. Yeah, we're good. All right, that's better. So let's just let this guy roll back in here and... Uh, just make sure I think we might have to set this loop hook thing here again. Loop hook. <clears throat> All right. Awesome. So I'm going to have a pile of loading here to do as well. And I think I might... Oh, boy. I don't know which way to take the train. It's going to need a pile of loading here. That's for sure. I'm not going to put you through sitting off all that, though. That's going to take a while. It's kind of neat seeing it come that way. Shouldn't be too fast here. I don't think we'll butt them off here. But So what are we going to take up? Six and six, I guess. Six, six loads of beam, six loads of... Uh, I guess split it out. They'll divide it up and use it as they need it. Okay, we'll let that come to a rest. We might just hit this one too. That's a lot of push power there, that's for sure. Okay, we'll start loading here. Um, do a couple for you here, and then we'll uh, we'll just load the rest. This is going to take a wee wee bit. This is going to be interesting to uh, be able to uh, see where we are here. But uh, anyways, we'll uh, start with beams, I guess, first. Everything comes nice and smoothly there. We got a lot of loading here to do. That's a lot of loading. That's at least a half an hour of messing about here. But we got lots, 100 on 100 of each, so that's good. But we can use the shadow here. When we're loading up the cordwood, I don't know the way that the way it's positioned. I guess you don't get a shadow, so it makes it really difficult to see. You know, because you can watch this shadow come to the end here, and you know and that's the yeah, end where you stop, right? That's your end. So. This is going to be tricky, though, coming around. I'm going to have to probably yeah, I'm going to stay on this line and go around, but I'm trying to get this uh, perfect here. <laughs> Do the beams first, and then I guess these after. All right, so we've got to watch these uh, sh shadows. We get up in the corner there. Watch the shadow of the cordwood. Yeah, when it ends here, we'll stop, and that'll be our first load of two loads, two cars of beams. Do, 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 and she comes to the end. Oh boy, you definitely need a second person to guide you. That should do about there. Okay. Away we load. This is going to be a heavy load. This is going to be pretty fun, though. 
So I'm going to have to unhook these at the top of the hill and then go down with these, I guess. If I had these on the end, that would have worked better, but anyways, I don't, so yeah. Well, we'll get the beams loaded here and then we'll start the lumber and I probably won't film the lumber part of it because that does take a long time. It's like loading the cordwood. It, it takes a while. These are pretty quick. Okay, the first load's ready there. The first two cars are ready. I need a track that goes straight. Straight, 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 straight. So then when I'm coming straight, I can look straight down there. Because I'm going to end up turning this cur corner here. Curve corner thing. And uh, I'm going to be like way over. And I won't be able to see that back in there where we are. But uh, we'll see what we can do here. Yeah, it's already going to be a problem. See that there, though. close. Okay, so that's two. This will make four. Probably more than we need up there right now, so we really need to start moving some uh, some uh, iron ore down. Cause that'll hold a thousand down there, but they only have 190, I think it is, up there in store, which is kind of weird. You think they'd store a little more than that up there? But, uh, we'll have to get some more cars though. Maybe add another. Well, let's see how much money we have. We don't have a lot. But 850, I think, a piece. So we could get. Get two of them, three of them, I guess. Add three more, so we'd have uh, four, five, six. That would move a bit. Okay, let's roll ahead again. Another two cars of beams. So now we gotta look way over. We started way over here, didn't we? Looking this way, now we gotta go way to this side of our screen to watch that shadow up here. And that's going to be the problem because that's why I wanted to do the beams first. That should be about good there. Do the beams first and then a little, it'll give us a little more visual on the, on the lumber here. Oh, we could have come ahead a little more. Might not be far enough ahead. We'll see where this dumps this first one here. It's going to be way forward. No, it's, well, it's working. <laughs> Sometimes they do mess up, though. Lots of stuff to take, though, which is good. Good stock of... Ah, yeah, I see that one messed up. I just need two more on that. It's going to probably not be enough. I'm going to have to probably roll it ahead again. Let's just see if it dumps one on here or not. That's too far this way. Yeah. Funny how it did the first one fine, but not that one. Oh, well. Anyways. Just roll ahead another half a car. <laughs> then we should be good. Half a car, eh? Maybe down about here somewhere. Yeah, that that should be enough actually there. Let's see here. Should oh, we should be able to get this back one? Oh, I should roll ahead a bit more. Oh, 
All right. Good, let's roll ahead now to... Let's roll ahead to... Uh, <clears throat> ah, man, something in my throat. Let's roll ahead to the next one here. And I'll, uh, I'll start loading these. I won't film that, though, because this, uh, this is going to take a few minutes. But we'll be back in a second. Now we're all loaded and ready to go. All right, we're working on the last one here. That was a complete nightmare. Loading that with that many cars on, you cannot see <laughs> where you are. <laughs> so it's like, well, that might be far. Look how far up the train is. It's like almost to the next next uh, thingy there. So I didn't enjoy that. I don't think I do that with this many cars again. Only just the trains, and then just do the cordwood on their own, and then just do this on their own. <laughs> I might mix a couple little things, but that's going to be have to be how we do it. I think so. Brought that for here, just to stock that up. Actually, what is this at now? Oh, it's zero right now, so that's not good. So we'll put this back in here. All right, let's do a save. Everything is good as it is. I had one car unhitched itself in the loading process, so that wasn't fun. Um, now. I wonder if I can just get this creeping through here slowly. So I can just run over here and check switches. Eh, it might not even move there. I don't know. I don't know. Because we're going to need to back all the way down the main line here. And not go that way, we want to go this way. So this switch, where the heck is it? Um, over here. We've got to make sure this, yeah, that's going, that's going the right way there. Let's just make sure. The thing is not moving. Okay, well, yeah, so that one's good there. I'm not going to walk all the way down there. We'll have to, uh, well, I guess we better... Lots of walking. I should really fix this here. This is not good either. Bring this up a little faster maybe, but uh, seems to track on it all right. So we've got to back up this way so we can uh, go uh, engine first. Actually, wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, that's what we want to do. We'll park the lumber and the beams up the top here, put the brakes on, leave them up there, and then take the other cars down, leave the cordwood down there, um, okay, so this needs to go that way, and that one is good this way. So just the one. We've got to go all the way past these and then switch that far one again. We should have the engine head going that way. Let's just have a gander over at this one here and see if this one is going the right way or not. Oh, it's way over here, isn't it? All these trees still in the way. Oh, man. Well, we'll become an engine first or anyway, so... Yeah, that guy didn't move at all. He's got 4% ray gun, just not enough to get him going. We are going to need some more logs probably soon. We're right out now, although the lumber and the beams are stocked right up. But it's nice to have the logs stocked up. But I don't think we'll do that today. We'll see if we can get this thing across the bridge here. Our new bridge. Oh, boy, I'm kind of nervous, but uh, excited in another way. So hopefully uh, she all goes good here. Here's hoping. So now just thinking, we'll probably use the express line first here. So maybe, well, cordwood first? Yeah, probably. So we'll put this back to uh, that one there. That one's already that side should be good. So that's the cordwood express line ready to go again. Although I'll probably check it again and use when I get, uh, get over there. All right, so four wasn't enough. Ten, will that get us rolling? Nope. To get some momentum pushing first, I guess. This is a heavy load. This might be too much for this little train. Just get a rolling gently. Maybe we should uh, take the tender off of this one, although I wouldn't have put it on this guy and drag it with this guy. We could have more wood, but I'll ah, we'll leave her there. We've got enough wood on this thing, I think. 
gently push her out. Let's just do uh, another save. I know. Another save. They need to get an auto save system in. about something all buckling up and screwing up back here. It shouldn't, because they're all loaded and heavy. It's just these ones, uh, they're not got a lot of weight in them. You know what I mean? But these all have weight in them, so they should be fine. I'm afraid of these kind of, like, buckling. I don't know. The game seems to be weird like that. Like, there's no way that would happen in real life. These things would be heavy enough to not have a problem. They should be, too, anyways. I don't know. I'll we'll just have to try and see here, I guess. That's a lot of train. I guess that's pretty much all the cars we own, two other than these ones. All in one train, <laughs> that's pretty crazy. Ooh, boy. Building up a bit more speed there, that's, that's all right. Maybe I'll grab a little more lumber or wood while we're going past here and put it in the top here. It's not rebuilding lumber or, or, or firewood for us there, so I don't know what the deal is with that. I got cordwood in there. You'd think it would slowly start building back, but it doesn't seem to be. And I don't know why. I don't, I don't want to spend all the time and bring all the other lumbers, like the beams, the lumber, the, the, the you know, the logs. That, that's just ridiculous. That's a pretty cool screenshot. <laughs> that's a lot of train. HUD. And there's quite a drop here, and they don't seem to have a problem with it. But I don't know. It's not. I'm not crazy about it. Should be able to go a little faster and rid of the big bends. Not sure a lot of train, I must say. That's pretty cool. Quite a little network of rails we got going on here, that's for sure. Rails going all over the place. It's quite a quite a conjunction, we'll say, of them all there. It's pretty neat seem to work good together too. Well, looking good. Uh, I gotta do a little review here. Um, to bring the rails and beams up. That's for logs and steel pipe. Uh, okay, so that's good. That's the one for lumber. Rail, okay, so we'll need these down there, I guess, to pick up some raw iron and rail at some point. I think we'll work on getting to the coal mine next video, though, which is going to be a pretty busy day. 
<laughs> but now we know to do the bridges a little bit better. We can maybe uh, figure out some different bridge bridge uh, bridging we can do. I say. All right, get this guy switched back here. Her down on hook. The lumber and beams. Better let him get right past there. Should get there now. Oh. Okay. Oh, that unhooked there on me, didn't it? Oh, you scum. Really? Why would it do that? It's unhooked there as well. Like, come on. I think everything else stopped, but okay, that's, that's all right. I guess we can look after that. Okay, well, let's hook this back up now. coming with us here. I'm leery that something's letting go back there, and you know what, I think something did. I think something did let go back here, and it's going down the rails now. Oh, come on. Maybe it didn't. Maybe we're good. Let's just do a count. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Lumber's good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good. Okay. Whew. It just didn't look right back there. I'm like, something's going. And it would just keep on going right all the way to the back. <laughs> it was a long way down, too, to go pick that up again. Okay. Well, that's good. Well, let's head her down to that junction down below here, and uh, we'll get these cordwoods unhooked. I think if you pull too hard, too fast, that's when things unhook for some reason. It's definitely a lot heavier. <laughs> we might have to do uh, some breaking coming down here, maybe. I'm not too sure if the uh, engine itself will be able to break all this weight. It's pretty heavy. Let's do another save, though. We're progressing safely here. I'm going to run up here and make sure this track's in our favor. I think we're going to have to switch it. I'm going to knock a couple more of these out, too. Through this corner a little better. We got switch. That one is actually good. Yes, we did that when we came down. That's right. Okay, I remember now. We better get on her here. She slowed right down on us again. Get some momentum going here. Should probably take a lot of these out too, actually.
So we will be coming down the wrong way here, but I think we can um, we get the cordwood down there. We'll take the left, we'll come back around, and then back in and up the hill again. Oh, well, that's going to end us up wrong on the top of the hill, isn't it? So we're going to have to come back around. Oh, it's going to be a nuisance. This can't come back around again. <laughs> Have the engine coming straight forward. Yeah, we want oh, I don't know. I can't think that far ahead. I'm going to have to think about that when we get down here. We come down the hill. We've got to come around the loop. And back in. Come back. We've got to go backwards up the... Yeah, we'll have to go backwards up the hill. To hook back on. I shouldn't think too far ahead because I get myself all mixed up there. Yeah. Right now, as it is, we're coming down the wrong way to go in to take the cord with him. This is why we've got that big turnaround thing so we can come back around again. Stop about here somewhere for the big track here, and uh, let those things sit there for a minute. So it's that there. We'll go down to the cordwood. Come ahead a little more. Uh, actually. Um, yeah, we're, we can come ahead a little more yet. Stop him, maybe out here somewhere. Put on a couple of those brakes, I guess. Hard to see way back there, but we're almost where we need to be. Okay, let's set some brakes and we'll unhook those. Drop this cordwood off while we're right here. I think it takes more time doing all the switching and unhooking and stuff and than just grabbing the cordwood cars and going and doing it. I think I better put the first three on. One would probably be enough, but I'd rather have more than enough. Okay, we'll unhook. That feller there. And take these down. Hopefully they stay there. Looks like they're staying. Yeah, I think so. Don't think they're moving. Hope not. They're going to be following us down if they are. Yeah, they're staying there, I think. Looks like it. Okay, let's head down with these. Big test, eh? Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> uh, it 
of going almost too fast-ish, but not too, too bad yet. So we're going to have to try to back up here with these cars. It should be fine. If these cars are empty. It shouldn't be a problem. But I want to take them up and drop them off over there on the other spur there. Um, so that we can uh, have them kind of up there when we go to do some coal. Although I probably should be doing some more of... Yeah, maybe I'll leave them down here too then. We're not going to need the coal for a while. we got a lot of work to do before we get that far. We're going to have to come back down here anyway. So we'll maybe do that. Leave them here too where uh, you know, we should be kind of thing. Okay, that's not stopping for me too well. Should have gone that way and around, but I guess I'll go this way and around too, either or, it doesn't really matter. This, I gotta get up here and switch that, or we're gonna be heading right into that uh, other siding there. I don't wanna do that. Gonna let him tour around there because we're gonna have to switch this switch too, and I don't know if he'll get around that far, but he might. Might keep going without any rag on there. <laughs> it probably will. Okay, so that because we're off to come past here and then back down into there, and then back around again. Yep, lots of work. Lots and lots of work. Okay, so this can now get switched back to go into there. Yeah, I think he'll make it around slowly but surely, but I know we got lots of rails and stuff to take here, you know. We gotta do uh, gotta do that. So but we gotta make it to the coal mine. Take a bunch of rails down, then we can take some raw iron. That's gonna be really heavy going up that hill though, let me tell you. I don't know how much this stuff weighs, but it weighs a lot. I think that's probably the heaviest thing in the game is that stuff. So that'll be fun. Fun, fun. Well, if we're going to leave all these cars down here, that means we don't have to uh, switch the train and go back around unless we want the train to be, you know, opposite way, which doesn't really matter. It'll still be on the same side of the cars that we need uh, up the other side there. So, so that's good. Old smelter's been working good. We got 100, 100 ready to go. Oh, this isn't quite 100 yet. She will be soon, though. All right. Here she comes. Here she comes. Oh, yeah, it's just ripping right along, isn't it? Pretty much full speed. Ooh, all. that hopefully past the switch here she should oh come on oh it's not gonna make it ah darn it I guess I should have run it all the way up now this is gonna be able to start up on the hill here but I don't know come on baby up higher, I guess. Oh, it's a run again. 
against the rain train. Sorry, not rain train. Run against the train. <laughs> oh boy. Switch her quick. Ah! Uh oh. Oh, we might have just made that. Oh, I think we got lucky with that one. <laughs> I think we got real lucky with that one. Okay, if she's going to stop in time on for us, though, here. Oh, that's not going to stop in time. That was scary. We made her though. Well, we might as well unload all this, I guess, now here too. So we had quite a bit of room left there. That's good. Not a ton, but had enough. All right, cordwood's building up. I don't think we really have any ore though. We're gonna have to do some more ore runs or something, or grab more cars, I think, to get more ore down faster. Because that's the problem. It's gonna take a while to get more ore. Okay, we'll let her uh, sneak to the back here, I guess. I don't think we're going to have enough room to store all these cars here. I almost need another switch here, maybe, just to park stuff off the main line here. Okay, we are back. All right. Should be able to buy ourselves some more cars too now for the for the coal and for the ore. All right, we'll, uh, should need a break on that. We'll uh, unhook that guy. An extra little switch going that way would not be a bad idea. I don't think I'll worry about that right now though. But... All right. Um. Forwards and break off and forwards. All right, we'll put these down that line, I guess, there. It's not holding itself back. That's interesting. Did I not put brake on on this thing? Probably didn't. I did. 100% brake. Um, wow. That's... Oh, no. Now it's only 36%. I don't know how far those will end up going. Try to get them past this line in case we want to just get down here for some more cordwood for some point. But I think we're going to have to do uh, some of these first here. So. We'll have to maybe grab a few more cars too. We'll grab maybe another. Well, how much money do we got now? 29, 87. We'll have a bit more when we take this wood up here too. there in case we want to get in here. Wish I had a little better direct route from here to up there. I mean this going around here and switching and then up the hill is kind of a nuisance but I mean I, I don't know if I could just make up up to there like that or not but um, okay so we're gonna have the engine going the other way now which shouldn't make a big difference. It's gonna look kind of funny but Better put some fuel in her, though.
we really should have brought those cars up with us, the hopper cars. That would have been an idea, so we could have brought some more ore down, but... Well, I just want to try this out today more than anything. We'll have to do some... I'll probably just do some ore in myself, maybe, and then get us kind of ahead of the game a little bit. Uh, let's see here now. We need a loop. Oh, what is going on here now? There. Loop. And we'll match these two up here. Should be good. Uh, we better switch the switch here too. Should be far enough past. Just in case she starts rolling back on us, we don't go the wrong way. Get this one undone here. And this one undone here. And we better do one of these. Because this is the moment of truth. What you've been all been waiting for all day here. Me too. Want to see if we can get across here. Okay, so this is the time-saving route, hopefully. Why does that seem like it's so heavy? We should be pulling down the hill. Did I miss a break or something? I don't think I did. Oh, come on. What is with this? Unhitching stuff all the time. My God. Goodness. I do not understand why that is doing that all the time. Stay. It's like you just hover your mouse over it or something. It seems to just take that pin out. That's that's really not good. That one's good. I think this one's good. I'll just check this one too. I think think we good okay I don't know why it's not really pulling nicely there but okay those two pins are in let's see here if we can get across this bridge I would have liked to have the train actually face the other way but that's the way she come about here that's okay Actually, not as much of a downhill until you kind of get here, I guess. Looks like it drops off here quite a bit. There's lower up coming through that switch there. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good. All here. All here and accounted for. All right. We're heading, uh, approaching her here. <laughs> I'm nervous. I am nervous. truth. Let's just do another one of these real quick here. All that work uh, putting this bridge across here, is it going to work or not? I'm trying to start building up some speed here. I'm going to slow that up a little bit. Let's see if we get turned and going up there. I'd love to stand back here on the bridge and just watch it go. <laughs> I don't know if I want to trust that, though. Going on its own like that. So far... So far, not too bad. It's this little mess right here, I don't know if I like it. I don't know what to do. Come off of here and across, I, I don't know. It might work fine. It might be a total disaster. It might be, uh, might be good. Who knows? Yeah, okay, that switch is good. We'll, uh, fingers are crossed, even though I need to have my fingers ready to go here. 
you cross your fingers for us, please? If this does work, man, this is going to save us probably about 10 minutes going all the way down here slowly and around the thing and then all the way up here. Save us at least 10 minutes bringing up lumber here. And bringing coal across, too. Here we go. Here we go. Rise is so far okay there. It's not great, but hear a bit of rake coming on here now. Oh, this is gonna work, I think. Maybe. Well, that's a hard turn, though. That's making our work hard. <laughs> Holy smokes, I'm so happy with that. Oh, that is fantastic. A little sharp there in that corner, but I mean, it's working. It's coming through nice. All right, wow. That's fantastic. Really good. I need to knock some of these trees out here so I can see this corner a little better. I think. Wow, off we go. Work great. Happy, happy. <laughs> we know the rest of the tour here will be a breeze, so that's good.
think maybe we'll just unload here today and then uh, just leave her here and then uh, we'll move her down on our next video here to work on the coal mine route. We did pretty good today. I don't want to hold you up too, too long. I don't want to hold you up all day, just most of the day. <laughs> All right, so we got the beams coming off first here, but the lumber first. I gotta remember that so when I load, I mean, it doesn't really matter. Either way, stuff will come off, but uh, yeah, that's good. I don't probably really need a whole lot of lumber beams yet either. But we'll, uh, we'll get paid for it, so that's good. Uh, they're down a little bit. Bit here, they've kind of restocked it to the 190s. So what are they short? No, not short on anything yet. That's weird. We've been away from here long enough. You think by now they might have been all restocked up? But uh, this will actually probably take all this wood. Actually, 16 of 50, and another 10 here. So that's about right. load right up. That's where usually it goes right through. be a break on somewhere. We gotta have a break on s somewhere here. Something's something's dragging. So normally this cycles right on through here, no problem. It's gotta be a break holding on somewhere. It seemed a little funny coming up there too, you know, I, I had a lot of rag on. I thought we were missing something. Yeah, this one's right on full here. That's the problem. There's your problem. So we were dragging up with a full. Oh boy. Yeah, now it's moving, see? Moving on its own now, so that makes sense. trouble is going to be here is getting all this stuff to do its thing too. Getting stocked up now. It's great. Should be making some good money too. 3707. Yeah, not too bad. Okay, you turd. Just go a little more. <laughs> I know one of these I threw a break on. There we go. Should roll ahead enough to get this unloaded. Boy, we're uh, pretty much stocked right up here. 30 of 30? Really? Really? <laughs> it's going backwards now on us. Oh, boy. Okay, well, let's try. Let's pull up here. Oh, you stupid thing. Again. Why does it keep doing that to me? Oh, this is really getting annoying, I'll tell you. There is no reason that that needed to do that. Oh, man, now we got to hook all this up again here. Holy smokes. 
I'll tell you. There's one improvement they need to make on this is when that thing's hooked, that thing is hooked. Unless the thing comes off the track. I mean, holy smokes, that is frustrating, that is. There's really no need for it to be doing that constantly, unhooking itself. That's, that's... That's almost sort of kind of making me not like this game a whole lot because of that. And I do like this game. Don't get me wrong, but... Man, when you're constantly having to fight with these stupid things unhooking all the time... I really wish I could get a hold of a developer on this game and say, you know, come on, dude. Fix this crap up. Or change the hitches. Like, you know, I know there was trains back then that had our modern hitches that they have now. Get the actual, you know, what I call hands that <laughs> hook together and they hold on to each other. Get them things going. That's what I say. All right, we'll get this last one off of here and then we will call her a day. I think we did pretty good here today. I'm pretty happy with it. All right. So, we made some pretty good money today. We got a nice, sweet new bridge built there. That works really good. And the next time we'll get working on the coal mine here, heading to the coal mine. It's a long journey to that coal mine. It is a long way, but now we know how to do some better bridges. Actually, that worked out pretty much perfect. We are fully stocked on everything. 30 and 50. Nice. Nice. All right. Well, there we go. That is it for today. That was a longer video, kind of than normal, but I think we did pretty good there today, so I'm pretty happy with that. Oh, I want to get up there, but it won't let me. Too high. Actually, I can probably get up here. And here. No, not gonna let me. But anyways, that's it for today. Thanks again for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. That is definitely gonna save us some some time bringing lumber up here over that new uh, bridge and stuff there. So that's great we got that in. But you guys have yourselves a good day, and we'll catch you all next time. And uh, we'll get working on that coal mine. All right. Till then, we'll see you later. You guys have a good one.